Hello everyone and welcome back to my Let's Play of Supreme Commander 2. And today we are going to start with the Illuminate part of the uh, campaign. So uh, we're not Maddox anymore, we are... I don't know what she's called. But um, we're going to stop a Cybran convoy or something. But from now on the missions uh, will become more and more fun. Well, not all of them. I believe there are some missions, of course, that aren't as much fun. But they become more large scale. So, even right now I have access to basically nothing. Just like as the UEF. But at least you fight uh, big or bigger battles. Jaren, where did you get this ACU? It's looking sweet. We still have some loyalists within the Illuminate government and military. We? Yes, we. Before I die, and considering how my body's been reacting to this new medication, that may be sooner than later. Stop that. Mom hung in for nearly two years after she hit stage four. I want to see our society return to the values and principles that Princess Rianne Burke taught when she was still alive. The Royal Guardians were her protectors in those days, and they're the only ones who can lead our people back to the way, and away from the UEF. That's quite a speech, brother. You should be in politics. I'm more of a behind-the-scenes guy. The brains to your prom. <sighs> they say you were quite the commander yourself back in the day. I'm pretty sure you could have taken me on the battlefield. Eh, you're right. I totally could have smoked you. That's my sister. We're here. What now? We have to stop an entire cyber navy. I got nothing. I have an idea. That won't work. They're too big. It'll work. Yeah, these guns have quite a kick. Is your little sister ever around? Okay, get the rest of the boats into the sound. I'd call that a success. Sure feels good to be blowing things up again. Yeah, well, get ready to feel even better. I'm picking up approaching Cybern signatures. They're early. You realize there's no turning back after this. Let's do this. Yes, let's do this. <clears throat> I hate this mission because let's go it's timed. One more time. An unmanned cyber naval force is passing through the Markon Delta to deliver a shipment of weapons. But it's okay. Our job is to send it to the bottom of the ocean and make the Cybrans think it's an illuminate hey, act of aggression. It's a monkey lord rack. Stabilize the government. A frame job. Excellent. The Delta features a natural choke point. The blockade is in place, courtesy of your friendly barge relocation program. When the Cybrans stop to clear the wreckage... I hit them with everything. There's been a lot of combat in the area. Recent, too. So anyone passing through is gonna be on alert. Keep an eye out for any working defenses you can capture. <laughs> That's cheating. Consider it a home field advantage. Yes, okay. Okay, the Cybrans are within radar range. Get your units into position and get some factories up and running ASAP. They won't know what hit them. And this one builds some energy. Uh, she's in there, okay. Let's go there first. New research options are available. Where? Oh, here. Um, let's do this. No, wait, I need this, actually. Unload. Uh, 
Um, can I build another one? Would be nice. You know what? I'll have this guy capture those things. Okay, so the point defense is almost mine. Unfortunately, the Air Force is coming. Okay, let's get in there. These guys start producing the fighters. Because the point defense uh, actually do quite a good job. Structure. Let's give them some more health and power and everything. Um, is one of the engineers done? Yes, yeah, this one. Both are done. Uh, where is? Where did I fly the transport? Wait, I of course need to select it first. I need some more mass. Let's uh, let's reclaim those things. Or is this actually no? This is a, a battleship. It's not a monkey lord. Thought it was strange because you can't use DLC units in the campaign. I'm pretty sure it's amphibious. I'm uh, missing some <laughs> some point defense there. Oh well. Um, can I build something else? What's this? Uh, radar station. Oh yeah, he's on the water. It's it seems like he's underwater. Oh yeah, I need to research that thing. In theory, it's really useful. In practice, not so much. Um, maybe if I add an anti-air tower, it might work. Oh, it's shooting at uh, this thing. Well, now it's dead. Oh, there goes my first base or whatever. I believe most um, of these units are amphibious because the, uh, the, the Illuminate don't have a navy. Uh, 
Okay, um... I might need some... Some support. Or not. Don't know for sure if I have enough energy. Probably, but let's just build some more. Let's repair this anti-air tower. Where is my engineer? There it is. Um, I better not build a... A land factory. Over there. Oh, new enemies. I hope my fighters are uh, enough to stop uh, this fighter horde. Okay, the ships have been sunk. But yes, the damage that I cause is uh, relatively small. So that's a good thing. Oh, I accidentally selected... Well, not accidentally, I, I, tr I meant to select the engineer, but I thought I had clicked on this transport. Oh, I have another air factory. I I'm forgot. Picking up an incoming command class aircraft carrier. Oh. I came prepared. Well, is that a bad thing or a good thing? The uh, command class aircraft carrier. I've never really used the aircraft carriers, I believe. If they're even recruitable, I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure they are. I just think that the the normal destroyers and this is uh, bad. An experimental soul ripper is in the air and it's heading in your direction. Uh-oh. Bring it on. That is seriously bad. <laughs> soul rippers are really powerful. I hope I can take it down. Hey, there's another tech uh, thingy. Oh, okay, time to attack. Okay, that's one. But if that thing reaches my uh, defenses, I'm screwed. Or, well, actually, it doesn't seem to be that bad. So, is that the carrier? Oh. Well, it pr 
it apparently has very good anti-air capabilities. I forgot about that. <clears throat> I don't know what it's doing, but uh, I think I need some anti-air guns and a factory that can cause or can build units that can cause some serious damage. Okay, so the carrier sunk, but the Soul Ripper is just hanging there, not really doing anything. Adding damage over time to my bombs, that might come in handy. Oh. The Yenzu tank. I don't like it. In the next mission, uh, I get access to uh, the most awesome units uh, in the game are one of the most awesome. Oh, my engineer's gone, so th this defensive position is, is screwed. Okay. Uh, the Soul Ripper is getting a little bit too close, but it's almost gone. Crash and burn. The Soul Ripper is down. Okay, it is down. Good. So now I don't really need these guys anymore. Wait, what? Okay, I was making the right ones. So, add damage over time bombs. Upgrade the damage of my land unit. I don't know what this slow unit is. Who cares? I have to intercept the air force. Oh, it's not a carrier. Okay, we got it, I think. There is another navy incoming. Okay, uh, let's put the construction of aircraft on hold for a bit. Let's just try to reinforce this area here. Oh, there are more aircraft over there with a, what probably a, is a carrier. Uh oh. Time to start repairing. Or not.
repair that one. Do it. Uh, okay, that one is gone. Gone. Mostly gone. Okay, so now we need to stop this force. This, this might be the last force, I don't know. But I'm going to send the army in. It's probably just a carrier with a lot of uh, aircraft. So I'll use a combined army. Oh, uh, well, that that thing is down. Oh, and we got it. I think. The Cybran Armada is now resting at the bottom of the Delta. Jaren? I just heard a report that UEF forces brutally attacked the new Cathedral Colony on Altair II. Hundreds of thousands of Illuminate are unaccounted for. No. Do you need any more proof that our so-called leaders are unwilling or unable to protect their own people? How have they responded? All they've done is condemn the attack. <laughs> Sounds like a good response. Proper response to the savagery of the UEF doesn't involve speeches. I'll pay for this. Yay! What this block has? Let's see. Oh, I I'm not exactly sure, but I believe. Because every mission has a hidden objective, I believe, over here is to... Why don't I have any combat? Oh well. Probably because my army really didn't do much or something. I don't know. But um, I believe this one is for uh, leaving the blockade undamaged. But I'm not entirely sure. But anyway, this was... Uh, it for today and next time. What are we going to do? I believe. Yeah, I believe this is where we, uh, we get access to my favorite illuminated unit. So yeah, um, but that will have to wait till next time. So for now, I want to thank you guys for watching, and I'll speak to you guys later.